What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another weekly overview. Uh, sorry about the whole black shirt again. I feel like I realized today, I was like, shoot, every time I, uh, I do these videos, I'm wearing the same exact thing. Um, so next week, we'll, we'll have, you'll see me in a little bit uh, different color, um, hopefully. Uh, anyways, guys, hopefully uh, hopefully you're having a good, uh, a good time training. Uh, please let us know or let me know if you guys have any questions or anything going on or if you need extra help, I'd be more than happy to help you. Um, this week we have we got a good week coming on. Um, I want the weekly overview or the sorry the day, the weekly focus to be um, let's focus on really giving it all we have for the strength components, right? So a lot of times intensity can be like kind of uh, misconstrued with like oh that was really like you know that was a really long workout that was really like I want to I want to vomit afterwards when typically intensity is it can be like like the highest intensity workout I've ever done or like some of the workouts I've done is like Fran, where it's a two and a half minute workout and it's everything you have and you're moving a lot of weight really quickly, right? Um, or like seven sets of three of a really heavy thruster, super intense. It doesn't have to be where you're super out of like, it's just absolutely just, you know, long, super long workout. Something like uh, seven sets of three thrusters is extremely intense because you're going, you're moving a lot of weight um, and you're doing it really quickly. Um, so, anyways, just a little, just a little piece on intensity. Um, so this week when we're doing like the Arnold presses and we're doing, uh, you know, the towel rows and the negative push-ups, really try to give it everything you have. Really try to break down that muscle, give the muscle a lot of intensity, just breaking it down. Um, either on the row, again, the like we have some split jerks and stuff like that. So try to focus on that. Um, let's start with Monday. Monday we have a simple day. Um, hopefully you guys can, um, you know, if you guys had a longer weekend or whatever, you know, whatever it may be, Monday let's try to use this week as just kind of a, a little bit longer, lower intensity workout. So five rounds per time, 400 meter run, 20 dumbbell squats, 50 jump ropes. Very simple. Um, it's going to be, again, low intensity, no rest after every round, and just moving at a slower pace for, let's say, 25, 30 minutes. Okay. Diving into Tuesday. We have a big superset. We have four different movements. So A1, A2, A3, A4. You're going to go all four movements, then back up to the top. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four for four sets. Okay. Here are the movements we have. We have single arm dumbbell Arnold press. Okay. So that's going to be with one dumbbell. You're going to twist. So start with the knuckles facing you, and you're going to finish overhead with the knuckles. Sorry, knuckles were facing out, and then at the very top, the knuckles are going to be facing into you. Uh, you're going to start with that. Again, you're only gonna have one weight probably. If you guys have more than one weight, fantastic. Use a little bit heavier dumbbell on that. Um, and they're gonna go single arm uh, over, bent over dumbbell row. Um, if you wanna put a little, a little bit of a negative on that to get some eccentric loading on that bicep, that works as well. Our third movement, we have V-ups, a lot of V-ups. We have four sets of 20 V-ups. If you guys need to alternate those, that's fine if we need to scale those down, okay? And the last movement, the A4, is gonna be lateral dumbbell uh, jump overs. We haven't had those in a while, so we're just going to jump over, over, over for 30 times. Okay? Big superset, just keep moving on that. All right? Wednesday, we have a little bit of a weightlifting technique piece to start. We're going to have a 10 minute EMOM of three clean pulls and three cleans, so power cleans um, on each side. Okay? So you're going to fill up a decent amount of that minute, so just be prepared to be moving pretty consistently for those 10 minutes. Okay? And then we have a 15 minute AMRAP of some hang cleans and split jerks. So you have 10 hang clean and split jerks. We're gonna alternate each rep there. So hang clean, split jerk, back down, other arm, hang clean, split jerk, okay, for 10 reps. Then we have 10 weighted box step ups with one dumbbell. I would say probably hold that either on your back or up on the front back position, and then 10 burpees. Just 15 minutes, a little bit slower movement, but be, try to be really methodical on those hang clean and split jerks. Diving into Thursday, we have a 20 minute AMRAP. We have 600 meter run, 30 dumbbell swings, 400 meter run, 20 hollow rocks, and a 200 meter run, and 10 five second negative push ups. That's gonna take a decent amount of time. You're probably gonna have to break that up and do smaller sets, but try to get all 10 reps done. For the 600, 400, 200, think about the 600, maybe around three minutes, the 400, maybe two minutes, the 200, maybe around one minute, just to kind of gauge what, um, how long it's gonna take you there. Um, that'll be Thursday. Um, moving on to Friday, we have every four minutes for six sets. Um, we have 10 floor presses, that's gonna be each arm. We have 10 towel rows with a three second negative. Now we definitely wanna get some eccentric loading on those towel rows. 
If you don't have a, uh, a towel, something super funny this week at, a, at our 6.15 a.m. class, someone said that um, he has two trees in his backyard and he grabbed a broomstick and put the broomstick in between the trees so it was hanging and he did pull-ups on there. Uh, so if you guys can, can try, to, try to figure out something creative like that, I was shocked. I was like, wow, that's genius. Um, so if you guys can figure out something like that where it's a little more creative, you're maybe using some, some landscape you have, um, that would be awesome just to get some pull-ups in, pull ups in um, as I'm sure you probably haven't done many. If you have a rig, obviously knock it out. That would be awesome. Um, just go with some eccentric pull-ups on that. Uh, all right, where was that? We are on Friday. We have After that, we have 10 front rack reverse lunges. So take your time on that. If you guys can, if you guys are watching this video, let's go with the, uh, an eccentric on the way down that lunge. Okay, so five on the right, five on the left. A three second negative, lowering that knee down. Okay, stand all the way up, squeeze the glutes up top, get a full hip, hip, full hip extension. Okay, diving into Saturday, we have in teams of two, a simple workout, a 25 minute AMRAP of six minute to run, 10 wall walks, you're gonna split that up with your partner, so you go, I go, you go, I go, 10 wall walks, 50 synchronized sit-ups. So at the same time, I want both hands touching, or all four hands, I guess, touching the ground behind you, and then hands touching the toes in front, and then 100 jump ropes. So take your time on that. If you need to go uh, singles, go singles. Doubles works great, okay? Um, hope you guys are having fun. Hopefully, some of you guys are watching these videos. Please reach out if you guys have any questions, and we'll see you guys next week.